previously during a live stream. We have had one hell of of a tour day. Oh yeah, we got a crew up in here. Hello, hello. Phoenix, you're my tour guide. Where are we going? I know there's gonna be a little bit of a delay, but we'll work around it. I'm already I'm already I'm already digging this. This is cool. We're gonna go over to the left here first. Wow, what a mood, y'all. What a mood. So I always appreciate uh plots that, you know, I gotta keep my camera low. I like that cinematic challenge, you know what I mean? Absolutely, thank you everybody for sharing. Absolutely, Peach. Absolutely. We got we got some clones up in here. This is fun. This is fun. Sorry, I meander a lot, so I'm gonna try to keep close. <laughs> Loving the juniper trees, right? Oh. Way to make a an area feel very sacred too. Do y'all think I'm underdressed? Hey Susan! Oh, Susan, you were named after a fish. Or a fish was named kind of after you. Always appreciate it when Susan stops by. This is cool. This is cool. <laughs> uh, it's, you know, it's fun. It's fun for me to see plots with like an entourage. It, it shows like a, a good sense of community here. Let's go. We got a, we got another, we got a bartender. <laughs> Y'all are prepared. Oh, this is so cool. Yeah, Susan, it's a it's a whole thing. You'll have to rewind in the stream. <laughs> oh, this is really cool. Oh, look at that. They're they're looking in the telescope. This is nice little astronomy room. Phoenix, uh, feel free to give us some context if you if you would so desire. Man, y'all thought of everything. You got like a, a plushie vendor too? No, you just have somebody hanging out with plushies. Y'all wouldn't have to know a, a certain uh Sleepy Sin, would you? That reminds me of uh, Cersei, uh, Cece from Tears of the Kingdom. Nice. I like a, a good, good gallery wall for sure. Very well done. I'm, I'm following you. I'm following you. Spy versus spy. Yeah, totally. Oh wow. Uh, interesting. Ooh, that's a cool design. I haven't seen that one before. Um, is this like? Like a game that you play with nine people? <laughs> Cause somebody's gonna lose. Hey Luna, first time you're here. Love watching your tours. Everyone is so talented. I love seeing everyone's progress and their creations. Yeah, absolutely. Welcome in. Following you, Phoenix. This is so well done. So well done. Yeah, I know. Musical lose. Somebody lose. That's for sure. Oh, what a nice little table setting. Really cool Phoenix Shrine, of course. Oh yeah, look at them. They're cooking away. What a beautiful, beautiful little kitchen area. <laughs> yeah, Luna, don't forget to join the Discord. We'll uh, we'll post a link in the chat for you. Oh, look at this workshop. I love this. Ooh, check out all these mirrors. That's really cool. That you know, there's like a there's like a really special art of mirror making, and the fact that you got like a whole glass thing. Ooh. We're teleported into another world. I backtrack a lot, don't mind me. <laughs> I feel like I'm being watched. Oh, we are going this way. Oh, nice. We got some uh, some silk being made. We got silkworms on retainer. Really cool looking bug room. What do y'all think about this plot? They got a whole entourage, right? I like how this is laid out. There's not like a area over here. Okay. Following you. It is so much fun. It, it is. Totally agree. Now we are off to the left. <laughs> the followers of the 10 toilets. But there's not 10 though. There's only eight. I love this. This is a really real decorated, fun little space. You know, I think it's just it's just so interesting. Like when we first start off with the tent and, you know, most people just like they, they take it down. They never look at it again. They just have houses. But, you know, when you take something like that and you just you turn it into a whole space. Oh, look at this area. It's so, it's so colorful and springy and all hell the toad. Frogbert. Ooh, look at it. Big natural rock. Nice place to tell stories. Cook fire. M math has failed you. I remember your tour of Bisky's plot. We had so much fun role playing during the tour too. Oh, sweet. I love that. I love that so much. Julie B. Homage to the frog. <laughs> Ooh. 
Ooh, yes. This is what's up. Nice bar area. I like how they stack the, well, they, they stack the barrels on the side. That's really creative, creative and clever. This is just, this is really interesting because like I've seen some implementations of this, right? But it's just so neat when people take this and, and kind of like Bisky's plot in a way, like you, you have a, a theme of, all right, this is where your, you know, your sweet leafers go and you got all kinds of different things. I want to figure out how to do that. It's a multiplayer thing, Ray. It takes more than one person, but it's like, this is, this is where you have your, your batters and your spreaders. And this is like where you cut and that's really cool. It's, it's good. It's very, uh, beginner friendly. Like, you know, if you've never been to like a cooking party before, it tells you exactly, exactly what to do, where to go, what the station is. Cause otherwise it can be a little chaotic. Oh, uh Oh, ah, fireworks. Y'all are fantastic. Well, that's one hell of a way to end a stream. Y'all are so fantastic. Thank you all so much. Thank you all so much. Ah, uh, y'all are so fantastic. Well, I I must I must bid the adieu. I'll say goodbye to my stream. I really appreciate each and every one of you. That that was just so that was so sweet. That was so so sweet.